You finished the final details on your 3D model in Substance 3D Painter, and now you want to get it in the glossy. I can help you out with that. Here's a model I downloaded from Polyhaven, link in the description. In most cases, you're already ready to export. You should skip ahead to that section of this video and give it a try. If your file size exceeds the max that Glossy allows, come back here because the next steps are for you. Go to the texture set list. Next to each of your texture sets, you'll see the set resolution for each set. Click on that and choose a lower resolution for the dropdown. If you don't see a noticeable change in the viewport or if you are okay with the change, then stop being greedy. You don't need 4K. Set them each to the lowest resolution that still looks good to you. If you still need to drop some megabit weight, let's look deeper into the texture sets. Maybe you have material channels that aren't needed. Check for emissive, opacity, or height channels and the like. If they aren't needed, get rid of them because Substance is creating textures for those on export and they are adding to the overall size. Now, whether you skipped to here or made your way through the entire video, congratulations, it's time to export. Go up to File in the menu bar, click it, then click Export Textures, or just hit Control shift e if you're feeling fancy. In the Global Settings, choose your Output Directory, and in the Output Template dropdown, select USDZ Apple AR. Then hit Export. Back in Glossy, we'll click the Upload button, then drag our model into the window. Once the upload completes, you can simply click the Create Project button from the pop-up notification. Name your project, then hit Complete. Once the studio launches, examine your model and get ready to create beautiful, stunning images using Glossy Studio. Then stop being greedy. No, that's too, that's too aggressive. <laughs> <laughs>